Hey everybody, this is Mac with Southern Bless Homestead. And I just wanted to um, show you one of uh, the cute animals, God's creation that lives on our homestead here. We uh, see a bunch of them every year and I've been meaning to like mark them somehow, put a number on their back or something like that. But we've got a lot of turtles around here and a lot of them we see every year. and um we see several times a year and we know because they have um like one of them's got like a crack shell in the front and one of them's got like a chip and on the side so we have identified them by that and uh, we just saw one today and took a little clip of it so we thought we'd share that with you um we've got quite a few of them around here we see every year and we've got so many around here that we actually are careful when we um when we mow so that you know we don't run over any of them but um and i post a lot on facebook of all the turtles and stuff that i've seen and people have given me the name of the turtle whisperer but because <laughs> i love turtles and i post a lot of pictures of turtles so anyway i hope you uh like this little clip we got thanks for watching okay here's our friendly turtle uh this turtle has been around for oh my goodness what three four years two three four years something like that the way we can tell is right here um when he was younger i accidentally ran over him i didn't see him with the lawnmower and it cracked his shell there and uh so that's how i know we see him every year and he literally patty was sh showing me something over there around the wisteria and i looked on the ground and he literally crawled across her foot and scared the crap out of her we were laughing so hard so but, but he's a really pretty little turtle yeah uh, he ain't afraid of us no. now most we picked time. we pick him up every year he's so friendly so <laughs> he uh, he don't even care anymore he don't even go back in his shell because we see him i don't know how many times a year he was laying up under a um, piece of plywood out back behind the house and i, I saw him and I put some celery and carrots and lettuce and stuff out there and he came out man he was munching down and eating and he stayed there a couple of days and so anyway we're gonna set him back down the direction he was going uh, that's why after that happened when I accidentally ran over him anytime the grass is uh, gets tall like uh, like something like this you know if it starts getting tall and I can't see good then um, I will, my first cutting, I will mow on high and then uh, I'll come back over it um, on a lower blade. And that way, uh, if, there's, if there's turtles in there, I won't accidentally uh, run over them because that, that, I love turtles and that just really broke my heart that uh, I hit him. So, because I'm, I'm a big turtle person. So, anything, anyway, I thought turtle, I'd share. Turtle share a little turtle with y'all there he goes on his little merry way <laughs>